Hello everyone, this is Tony and Wayne with Genuine Comfort and we got some more videos for you today. Today we're going to talk about 4-wire versus 5-wire and I know that's a term that maybe most of you may not know unless you've bought a thermostat and you're trying to put it on. So I'm actually going to turn time over to Wayne and we can talk about that because he's got some things to go over. So Wayne, awesome. go ahead my friend. Thanks. So uh, in a case like if you want to upgrade your thermostat and you want to be able to use the circulate mode or be able to have a Wi-Fi operated one so that you can do it from your phone and all that. So we go into houses and most of the houses have four wires behind the thermostat. So one of those wires needs to be hooked to what you call the common wire. And with, there's a thermostat out there, Nest, and then there's another one, Ecobee. Ecobee actually has what they call an atom wire that comes in the kit with it. Mm -hmm so that you can not only uh, use that uh, extra wire for your common, but you'll still be able to use your fan wire, so, you know, fa fan settings separately. So it makes it so that you can use the circulate mode. That's one reason why we choose Ecobee over Nest. Uh, they say that uh, you don't need five wire, but in the wintertime when you have uh, more energy being used by the actual furnace, because more things are going on inside of the furnace, then it, what happens is the Nest thermostat steals the power away from the thermostat to try and charge. And sometimes it'll go off, go offline and say it's not keeping up. Anyhow, it just seems like a, something we have to constantly deal with. But once they move to an Ecobee thermostat, it solves the problem. Yeah. Awesome. And well, that's some good insight. And again, I'm, me personally, I do like the Ecobee over the Nest um, for that reason. So great. Anyway, Tony Wayne, Genuine Comfort. Thank you. Thanks.